Hey, did you ever want to hike an active volcano in the middle of the night to see an amazing sunrise? Come and join me, drop the one minute intro. Ooh. It's 2.30 a.m. in the morning on Pier de la Reunion, Reunion Island. We are heading towards one of the most active volcanoes in the world. Last eruption was in September and we have now October. In the 1970s, the last really big eruption happened, which formed most parts of this volcano we are hiking and destroyed a good part of the south of the uh, of the island. Piton de la Fournaise, and excuse my French here, is the second tallest one uh, with about 2,600 meters. Having a guessing game right now here on how many cars are actually already on the parking lot at about 3.20 in the morning. Uh, my guess, zero to three. We made it to the parking lot on top of the volcano. The answer to our question was there were two more cars. Now we're gonna head up there and see what it's like. I mean, it's freezing cold, so we have a bunch of layers. It's gonna be an adventure. They have these white markers here, so you don't get lost in the desert of lava fields. You literally don't see anything. You can see the Milky Way, which is absolutely fascinating. Holy shit. Super windy up here now. And we, we climbed literally, already for one and a half hours. I'm in the middle of the, middle of the climb. That is awesome. After a two hour hike, we made it to the top of the volcano. It's absolutely gorgeous. This sunrise was magnificent. This is the third volcano that I climbed for sunrise. The first one was in Iceland, the second one was in on Bali, and this one is now on La Reunion. Definitely the most difficult climb, but also I think the most rewarding one. <laughs> in there when you turn around you have the sunrise over the Indian Ocean Mind blown. it's absolutely stunning all right now down 
Alright, 7.55, I reached my step count goal. It's getting warm. Okay, a little conclusion of, of this trip. If you are somewhat trained, I mean like if you feel fit and adventurous, then I totally recommend doing this. It's it's breathtaking, I mean the sunrise was just magnificent and the hike as well. It was so much fun. Oh, it is so much fun. I mean, I still have half of it in front of me because I just left, left the peak. Bonjour. Very humbling experience as well. And again, this is one of the most active volcanoes in the world. Unfortunately, there's no eruptions right now, but in September, like a month ago, there were some. We made it back. Um, we left at 3.30 from here, where literally like, just two cars were with us. Uh, and now there's just like a crazy amount of white cars. And it's 11.52 now. It's been a over four hour hike and a lot of time on the volcano. And this is the first time me sitting down really. And it's gonna be heavenly. Ay. Ay. Back home. Thanks so much for coming along on this amazing hike. I hope this gave you kind of an idea of the experience when you hike such a volcano in the middle of the night and the views you get afterwards. If you're around in the area, definitely check it out. I don't know why I'm doing this fog thing. I mean, I guess just because. Have you been on an amazing hike? Please let me know in the comment section. Maybe I'm gonna check it out. I, I always appreciate some cool recommendations, so let me know. If you like this video, give it a like. There will be more coming from Reunion Island. Just subscribe here if you haven't done so yet. Uh, would really appreciate it. Check out another video right there and as always, thanks so much for watching. Have a good night, have a good day, have a good morning. Wherever, whenever you are around the world, thank you so much. Bye-bye.